Hello guys, never thought I'm gonna make this type of video, but here it is. As you probably read the title, yes, it's strange. You probably don't even know me. Unless you're one of my subscribers, and damn, I love you guys. If you happen to stumble upon this video, then I welcome you here to my channel too. On topic, it's pretty disappointing that part two of the update didn't come out. A lot of people have said it already, I know, but it sucks. It didn't even bother me at first. But when the part one update came out, they also announced these plushies and figurines that you can buy and added the chance of a permanent fruit coat. I would have been fine with that, but like, they're selling these in my home store now. It's just absolutely weird that something like this happens faster than an update. They removed Dragon as a permanent fruit that you can buy. It's okay if Winter Update 2 had actually come out for Christmas, but now it's October. You really couldn't buy Dragon for almost 10 months. And if the update doesn't come out this winter, it'll be even longer. And since some leaks say Dragon will cost more. Imagine that. You waited almost a year to buy it permanently, only for it to cost even more. Another fact I find really funny is that the Roblox Bloxy Awards 2024 got abused just because of the whole update thing. Guys, as many of you in the Bloxy Discord server know, Adam and E promised that a leak would drop if you wanted to vote for the best action slash RPG category in 2024. So that's where it all started. You guys went absolutely crazy on those votes and we won with nearly 1 million votes. We're extremely grateful to all of you for voting for Block Troops, even though the update is taking longer than we expected. Even though the update is taking longer than we expected. So I do want to apologize for that, but stay tuned. We are going to drop a bank. What the heck? Who did block proof like this action? <laughs> Those cost aren't with proof players. Okay, what about best strategy? Strongest battle rounds? It's not even a strategy game. KJ, 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 KJ. Hey, but Blocks Fruit isn't the only game that does it. It's funny how real the comments were under the video. Blocks Fruit isn't even an RPG, unless I'm some kind of weird shark person trying to hook up with other races. What's the end goal anyway other than grinding? And don't tell me you think PvP in this game is something you want to do all day. I have videos of me actually fighting people and showing what they do. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. It's not the only thing, also it's sad how many content creators milk blocks fruits for leaks, or the insane clickbait just to repeat what they said in their last three videos. I mean, we are all just waiting for the update now, and I can't blame everyone. I don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. I don't need it. Before you say I have no idea about Blocks Fruits. I have streamed the game and made many meme videos about it. I have given some people fruits from a giveaway I did, and even some Robux passes. I have also helped many subscribers get the Leviathan Heart and Martial Arts and much much more like Fruit Awakening or God's Chalice. Anyways, to sum the topic up. 
Stop watching leak videos. They are a complete waste of time unless they come from the official Blocks Fruits YouTube channel. Now all we can do is wait for the update. Honestly, leaks should not always be trusted. Only if they actually come from the Blocks Fruits creators or close YouTube friends, they know better. Also, why am I not a verified Roblox YouTuber? No joke. That's the end. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you want to see more content, of course.